pleased to be here today. And I, I call it the Sikh Day or the Sikh Day Parade. But I, I was ex it was explained to me the uh, religious significance of the day uh, because of the tenth prophet of Sikhism, uh, who basically gave the five uh, symbols: the the turban and the uh, and the sword and the beard and the other things that that you associate with the Sikh religion. I just wanted to say that um, I've long been. Um, an observer and, and, and tried to learn more about Sikhism. Um, I actually went uh, many years ago to Punjab and went to the capital in Chandigarh. I never did get to the Golden Temple, but maybe someday I will. But I've been, I do represent in uh, Woodbridge and Carteret and Edison and most of Middlesex County, the largest Indian community of any congressman in the United States. And the Sikh community is a very important part of that. Uh, it is kind of sad in a way because when I learned about the significance of today, I also thought about the fact that those five symbols, including the turban and the sword, are almost are also, unfortunately, the things that maybe identify Sikhism and to some extent have caused the discrimination and some of the violence uh, that has uh, been perpetrated against the community and some of its members over the last few years. And I constantly preach against discrimination and against profiling. I think that we have to do whatever we can locally as well as at the state and the federal level to eliminate that kind of profiling or the fact that people see each other in a way that sometimes contributes to violent activity. We can't tolerate it in this country because this country is not what that's about. This country is a country where everybody should be seen equally and it doesn't matter what you look like or what you wear, or what your religion is. But I do want to congratulate you again today on this very special day. Hope to learn more about Sikhism. I had an opportunity to go to the Gurdwara in, in Fort Reading uh, last year, and I'll continue to visit uh, the Gurdwara and be involved in your activities. Thank you again.